All right, so let's pretend that you got locked out of Pearson or the website wasn't working. Maybe you lost your workbook and you're not really sure where it is. Um, this is how you can get your Envision Math workbook even if you, you don't know where it is. So here's like a, a workaround for that. Um, you're gonna go to pearsonrealize.com, P-E-A-R-S-O-N, and then realize, R-E-A-L-I-Z-E.com. Put in your username and password and then push sign in. Um, if it's your first time signing in, you're going to have to choose your um, language, which picture that you want, and then just click with, like, go ahead and let's go. Um, if you have an assignment that you need to complete, you're going to go over here and click my work. Um, if you have lost your workbook, if you click explore, it'll let you see the workbook. Um, and then if you have a certain um, topic that you know that you're in, like right now we're in topic 11, you can click topic 11. These will bring you to some little videos and stuff that you can watch in order to um, better understand. Let's say that you, you didn't know where your 11-2 assignment was, you can click on the interactive student edition and that'll bring you to the workbook. Oftentimes it's gonna want it to pop into another window um, it does take a couple of minutes to load sometimes, so just kind of hang tight for a minute. Um, here's what the workbook page looks like. Um, you can scroll through the pages. There's also like where you could do some work on the page if you needed to. Um, but if you are doing this, it's not going to share that work and save it. This is um, only gonna show you what the pages look like. So it wouldn't have an option to turn this in. Um, you would have to use a piece of paper to write on in order to, to turn your answers into your teacher. Um, so you can just scroll through, those pages are on there. I'm gonna just push exit. If you were like maybe having some struggles on one of the lessons, you can go back and there's um, a spot, it's called visual learning. That'll just give you, it's usually about two or three minute long videos. Um, that just kind of reteach the lesson. Um, so in addition to watching the video that your teacher teaches, you can click visual learning and that'll, that'll have another little video snippet on how to, how to do that skill. Um, let's say that you had a certain workbook page that you were looking for. I'm looking for where it says, I can go back to where we were. Um, let me see. Yeah, here's the go back button. Um, if I keep going back, like let's say I had a specific workbook page that I wanted to find, you can click on the whole interactive student edition um, and it will let you select which page number that you wanted to go to as well. So that's another option if you were stuck and needed extra help. Um, you can scroll through any of these areas. This is where you, if you, if you didn't have like let's say a practice test, you'd be able to, to find the practice test on these pages where if you click just directly on which topic that you're learning about, um, you, you don't have the option for the practice test. So any other pages that might be somewhere, we would be able to find over in this area. So that's how to log in for your Envision Math workbook if you lost it or if you wanted to have a reteach lesson. Um, that's all I got for you. I hope that helps.